Chapter number eight is team uniformity shifting over to team diversity. Now, this is the improvement shift, and let me tell you why. The improvement shift is all about embracing the ways that diversity of thought and experience will increase your team's ability to succeed. In the beginning, I wanted everybody to be alike. And then I found out that, to be honest with you, if all of us are alike, we're really not helping each other. What I need is people maybe not to compete with me, I need people to complete me. That's what team diversity is all about. Bringing people in, different ages, different backgrounds, different nationalities. People that can come and, and bring their expertise to the leadership table and they can complete me. The number one question I'm asking the corporate community is the millennial question, where they're basically saying, how do we interact? How do we connect? How do we, how do we motivate millennials? And I share with them that the first step to work with the millennials is to truly value them, who they are, and what they can provide to you and for you right now. Not try to change them, but try to connect with them. You see, you can't change a person until you connect with them. You don't want to go correcting people. First, you want to start connecting with them. Then you can make the changes that are needed. Team diversity is so valuable. I have so many people around me, different backgrounds, experience. Most of them, of course, obviously much younger than me. And I look at them and I see what they're bringing to the table for me. And to be honest with you, I couldn't make it without them. And neither can you. So be secure. Secure people want diverse people around them. Insecure people, they want everybody to kind of be just a little bit less, but kind of like them. You want to live in that secure world and make that shift, it really will make your team a lot better.